welcome to my channel. This is my first ever YouTube video. First ever YouTube. So is Savannah Sharp Fitness. You can follow me on Instagram at Savannah Sharp Fitness. And I'm going to put that in the description box. I also have a bikini bodybuilding blog called Cakes and Protein Shakes, where you can follow along when I will post about all things bikini bodybuilding. And here, so a little bit about this channel. I wanted to get started in the YouTube business for a very long time. I just kind of didn't have the courage to start recording. So now I have my YouTube studio. We are here in my guest bedroom. Hence, I have extra shoes. We have a mirror, TV. Um, uh, whatever. This is just our extra spare bedroom, so I'm going to use this as my YouTube studio, so I'll be updating um, you guys here weekly, hopefully. Um, I'm also going to do, the, hopefully, the road to nationals, hopefully the road to pro. Um, so there's so many different things that I want to do with this channel. That is my dog, Blue. I have a dog mom, so this is going to be super fun. Today's video is going to cover the top four item gym bag must-haves. So the reason why I'm doing this video today is because this company, Pro Fitness, reached out to me and they wanted me to review some of their products because obviously I am an avid fitness lover. I'm a bikini bodybuilder. I am still an amateur. I'm working my way to get my pro card and I will be doing nationals this July, July 24th and 25th. I will be in Las Vegas, Nevada to compete hopefully to share the stage, potentially win a pro card, and also to get feedback from some of the best judges in the country and to see kind of where I stack up against other girls in my height division as well. But we're gonna go over top four items that are gym bag must have. So these items are things that are regulated in my bag. I'm gonna give you a review of them and they're all from Pro Fitness. And I am going to give that link for where you can go purchase these items if you want in the description box. The first item that I am going to go over and review is a lifting belt. So this is a soft cloth lifting belt. It is adjustable. So it does have a Velcro strap where you can put it on and off your waist. Um, I really like this because my waist is always fluctuating because I'm competing. So um, whether it's off season, on season, whatever, it is super adjustable and you can get yourself kind of tight. It almost acts as if it was a waist trainer as well, which is fantastic because you know, us bikini bodybuilders wanna keep that core nice and tight. So when you're doing legs, you don't wanna really engage the oblique. So that's something that can make you a little bit thicker. So I will try this on and show you guys how that looks. number two that you need as a gym bag must have. This is something that's a game changer for fitness. It is a leather lifting belt. So this is actually how I found the company. I was scrolling through Amazon and just looking for a lifting belt and I came across Pro Fitness. So their logo, it looks just like this. It just says Pro Fitness with a little weight and it was black. I wanted something black that wasn't going to be logo intensive. I don't want to have to just be you know how some companies have a giant logo on the back? I didn't want that. I just wanted something simple, black and leather. So it already comes, um, most leather belts, they're gonna come like straight. This one already comes kind of like, I don't know, in a waist shape. So it's already kind of um, contoured toward the waist. It is adjustable, so it has multiple rings that you can adjust. So I have a size small. Right now my waist size is about 27 inches, and I just like to wear this lifting belt when I'm doing heavy legs so I don't hurt my back. And also, um, I don't want to engage my oblique um, muscles while I'm lifting because that's going to make really bulky abs. And bikini is all about that small hourglass waist. So I will try this on, let you guys know. It has two prongs and I'm gonna give you a try this on and show you what it looks like. Okay, so the next product that I wanna go over is more of like um, an exercise, something that you can't wear but you can use. It's a squat sponge. This is perfect for when you are lifting. Again, it's by Pro Fitness and I got the color red. It looks like this, so it is literally a sponge that goes over the bar. So when you are doing squats or you're doing glute hip ridges, which is my favorite, especially for bikini. Again, we're trying to build a booty. You wanna build a booty. Nothing is worse than trying to 
put that heavy metal bar on your hips. And if you don't use this, you're either having to look around the gym, fold up a yoga mat or fold up something just to put and cushion your hips. Otherwise, if you just do it without any sponge at all, you're gonna end up with bruises and it's gonna be super uncomfortable for you. So when I am doing hip ridges, I will put this under the bar and it will just sit right on my lap on my hips. That way it's going to give you an extra cushion. It's nice and thick. It's firm. Um, and then they also come with these. So my other brand that I have um, just searched off Amazon, I have another one of these, but they did not come with these straps. So these straps are so that once you put it in the, on top of the bar, then you just strap these over. It's a Velcro strap, so it stays on the bar and it's not gonna move. Because I've been in times in the middle of my lift where I'll turn a certain way and then the sponge will fall off or it will, um, this part where it like slips in, that's gonna kind of be on my hips and then I still don't have that sponge on my hips. Super uncomfortable. Same thing when you're squatting. Nothing is worse than having that heavy bar on your neck so we just will pop this on onto a bar, Smith machine, whatever it is. And then you can just put it and it kind of just would sit like this on your neck. It's not going to be too heavy on you. It's not going to hurt you. It doesn't feel weird. It's just a nice cushion. And again, with those Velcro straps around the bar. So when you have them, even if it's going to twist, it's going to be locked in place. That way, when you are squatting, it's not going to move at all. And you're going to have a super awesome leg day. This is Ladies Bikini Body Building Essentials. Get this in your gym bag. If you don't have it, you need it. And I'm going to put all that links in my bio. The last product that is a gym bag must have for bikini bodybuilding, especially like obviously you're going to see a theme on my channel. It's going to be all things bikini bodybuilding, but bands. So it comes in this nice little secure black pouch and inside are lifting or workout bands. So I'm probably seeing it all over Instagram. There's girls with these bands doing band exercises. And the ones that I got are cloth. So they come in three different sizes. They have a dark blue, they have a pink, and they also have a purple. So they're all different sizes and um, different strengths of rubber bandness. So with um, all of these, they're gonna have this super cool, it's almost like a thick headband. So you know, if you have a headband on and if it doesn't have little grippies, it's gonna slip off your hair. Well, these have a rubber grip inside, so that way on your leggings, if you have them on your legs, no matter what movements that you're doing, they're not gonna slip while you're squatting, lunges, whatever it is that you're using a band for. So normally when I lift, I lift with my bands are rubber, but these are more of like a cloth fabric stretchy material. So there's not as much um, stretch to them as if it were a rubber band. But the good thing about these, it's thick and it has that non-slip grip there as well. And then also, since you're not going to get as much stretch to them, it's just really going to make you like force yourself to utilize those glute muscles while you're lifting. So when you have these around your knee, so if I do squats, I have a bad left knee. So I really want to focus on pushing my knees out because sometimes in the squat, my knees are going to cave in and we don't want that. So to really hit the glutes right, I would wear this band or one of these other bands over on top of my knees. And then I would focus on pushing my knees out the entire time. That way I can really focus on those glutes, those um, feeling the muscle mind connection. So these are perfect for doing that. Um, there's various exercises that you can do and it comes in three different types. That's all that I have for this video. I just wanted to keep it short and sweet and give you a little introduction about who I am, what this channel is going to be like. So I am a new channel. I desperately need ideas, comments, subscriptions. Please let me know what kind of videos that you would like to see. If you like this video today, please tap the like button. Post on your story if you're watching, if you liked it, whatever it is, you can DM me on Instagram. I'm very active there as well, but I'm so excited. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Again, I have no idea where we're going to take this. Bikini bodybuilding, my road to pro, hopefully going to be my trip to nationals, competing behind the stage. It's going to be a um, fashion show, getting ready, modeling, photo shoots behind the scenes, uh, meals, whatever you guys want. Just tell me. So go ahead and 
Comment below if you have any ideas. I would really appreciate you. And as always, I'm going to finish my videos off. My name is Savannah Sharp. Thank you for watching. And remember, diet smart, train hard, and stay sharp. I'll see you next week.